Hey guys, so uh, some things changed. Uh, I can now kind of go out and do things in the uh, the winter and kind of go anywhere that I want now. The uh, vehicle got changed. I'll be showing you guys that today, talking about kind of what happened. But uh, Kaz and I are deciding we're going to go to Painted Rocks Reservoir. There's a dam, and we're going to try to fish. It is December 26th. No, January 26th. This will be interesting. So recently, um, I've been having a really hard time just going out and doing anything, but as of late, it's actually been really nice because I picked this up a few days ago, and it's just been, it's been uplifting to know that I can go out and do stuff. My Subaru wasn't a bad car by any means, but... I got magic cards! <laughs> this, this is much, much nicer. So we're sitting outside, or inside the uh, Coffee Cup Cafe for breakfast. I look outside in the snow, I swear I see a golf ball. And I run outside and I see it and I go, it's gotta be a golf ball or a ping pong ball. It's a fucking golf ball. <laughs> Number two. So we just got done eating at the Coffee Cup Cafe here in Hamilton. I gotta say, that was one of the best meals I've had in a long time. Have you ever, ever down here? Stop him. It's a great place. So uh, we just pulled off at a job core area up by Connor, Montana, popped the car into four wheel drive. Roads aren't quite as maintained as we thought they would be, so we're gonna get to really run the Jeep through its uh, versatile test, see how it does. I'm super excited. So we just came around this corner and we just saw that ram and a bobcat, which I've never seen a bobcat before, and that was just, that was amazing. We turned this corner and we found this pullout, and I know now know why it's called Painted Rocks up here. Oh, I forgot it was what it was like to come out and do fit photos. It's so nice, so fun. It's beautiful. Painted Rocks Lake right now, and uh, some of my favorite fishing spots in the summer. 
And if you look down here, this is where, you know, uh, most of the fish that come to spawn, this is the farthest that you can get because we're on top of the dam right now. If you turn around, the lake's behind us and it's not even half of the size it is in the summer. And uh, basically what happens is uh, the bull, we got the bull trout and the cutthroat and the brown trout that spawn here during throughout the year. Uh, the bulls run in August and July. They come up to this dam and they all gather in here. Uh, later in the year, in like November, October, you get the brown trout do the exact same thing. And then as you go into March and April, you get the uh, rainbows and cutthroat that come in through here as well. Big difference though then in uh, uh, the summer through the winter. As you can see, the lake is about half of what it is in the summer right now. So we decided to, uh, we left Painted Rocks and we are uh, going up through kind of Lost Trail area to go to Wisdom, Montana. Kaz and I kind of have a, a fun history with this. We came up here three years ago and we decided we wanted to just kind of take a trip. We went through Wisdom all the way through the Big Hole Valley down to Ennis. Then we came all the way up into Bozeman and then came all the way from Bozeman all the way back to Missoula. That trip was supposed to go just the Idaho border. My parents called me in Bozeman. Oh yeah, where are you at? Oh, Bozeman. Actually, you're going up to Lewis Clark Caverns in Butte. Oh, okay. I get a call from my dad. I can hear my mom screaming in the background. What the hell am I doing in Butte? Ah, there's a to be on the border. It was, it was funny. Good times, good memories. So we're here in Wisdom, Montana. Um, nice little town, but we're gonna turn around here and head home, it's time. So uh, I don't know if we're gonna stop anywhere else, but this might be it, so there's nothing else. I'll, I'll make, well, we'll, we'll, we'll stop somewhere. We'll figure it out. <laughs> 